Nowhere Man, for example, that solo in Nowhere Man's amazing. It's just, it's done with chords, you know, and then there's a harmonic at the end of it. Nobody would have thought of that. And the sound was so trebly and so sharp and so clear. So I started using it that next session. Uh, it was uh, probably Hard Day's Night. It's right there on the opening, the downbeat of Hard Day's Night, that chord. And I used it right through, I should have known better, right through a lot of the songs in Hard Day's Night. And I think the last Beatles song that I, I recall playing on uh, the Rick and Becker 12 string was Ticket to Ride. Yeah, this is the first guitar, my first American guitar, that is, the first real decent guitar that I ever had, which I bought uh, in 1960. It cost me 75 pounds and I bought it from a sailor in Liverpool who advertised it in a local newspaper.